Hi, it's Steve from Brownells with another gun from the vault. And today we have the 1893 Marlin Repeater. This is a carbine version, and this is quite a little rifle for its day. It's chambered in 3030, and this design preceded the mighty Winchester 94 by a whole year. So let's take a look at it. It's got the Marlin side eject, which Marlins are famous for. That debuted on the 1889 model. And what this is, is a lengthened and strengthened 1889. You know, the 89 shot things like 4440, 3840, 3220, you know, the pistol cartridges. Whereas this is made for larger 3855, debuted in 3240, later on 32, or excuse me, 3030 and 32 Special. Um, this is the right size deer gun here. For most use, this has got all the power you need, just like the 94 Winchester did. And when you hold these two side by side, they're very close in size, weight, everything. They were direct competitors, no question about it. Now Marlin already had a big frame gun, the 1881, that took large cartridges like the 4570, but everybody was talking about high speed, small caliber guns. So the 3240, 3855 was considered kind of a small caliber back then, actually. And of course, the 3030 was just on the horizon, so this gun came out just at the right time. Nice workmanship, typical of any old Marlin. Smooth action, nice strong design, and Marlin touted the closed top as a safety feature. We didn't get stuff blown back in your face, no brass coming up over your head like the Winchesters. I don't know, I love my Marlins and I love my Winchester, so I'm not gonna say anything either way there. Now this particular Marlin is in my own collection, out of my vault. I bought it from a friend of mine uh, down in Missouri. And he'd had it for a long time, but didn't need it for deer hunting anymore, so I thought, well, maybe I'd take care of it for a while. Anyway, if you have anything you wanna say about this gun, if you have one, had some adventures with it, let us know in the comments below. In the meantime, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time with another gun from the vault.